us versus them. I think that that thinking had something of a catalytic effect on my road to non-faith. Um, recently, the people of Northern Ireland have made peace with each other, and I, that's kind of carried over into the Irish communities, the diasporas, in the various bits of the world. Probably Grey Tex, equally true of the Irish in Glasgow. I don't know what part of Scotland you're from, but I know that the, uh, the Scots in uh, Glasgow are often divided into two communities, not to the extent of Ulster, of course, but, you know, it's at least in the past they were. That's dying out now in Canada. <clears throat> it's not dying out in Ulster, of course, but uh, at least they've learned to, or they've decided not to perpetuate the conflict. Um, and with that, a corollary to that is a hesitancy to attack the other guy's religion just because it's religion. It's almost like you're thinking, look, we've done that for umpteen gazillion years, and look what it, where it's led. These people have what they believe they're not going to change, and just attacking them for it is something almost of a taboo, because you don't attack people that you're trying to make peace with. Or at least you don't attack them simply for being what they are. Or for believing what they believe. This is a very important part of their identity. So I guess, in a sense, um, that kind of spilled over. I'm all... I'm more than happy to attack uh, uh, the Catholic Church, uh, Catholicism in general, all that kind of thing. But maybe because of that sort of peace process, sort of eggshells feeling, I'm hesitant to attack uh, evangelical Protestantism uh, too strongly, simply because it does bring back that bitter taste in the back of the throat of us versus them. It's not that I believe anything that the evangelicals have to say. Uh, it's not that I have any deep down respect for what they believe, but I just, if I were to attack it, I would suspect my own reasons for attacking it. It, it would just be, it would remind me too much of, not really the bad old days, because I never really lived through the bad old days, but just the, the bad old subconscious thinking. 